I don't know. I expected the sky to be purple or something. Don't believe everything you see online. And what makes you an expert? Shell in archives. I studied a lot about Outworld. No substitute for experience. So what makes you our leader? Guys, let's stick to the mission. See how mine taught us when we go to the ad one. Well, I is not on the floor for that. Lee Mei has to be telling the truth. An invasion would violate the Reiko Accords. You can always trust an Outworlder. But if Outworlds are ally, why didn't they help us during the Netherrealm War? Against Quan Chi and his team of... Revenants? Like Jackie's dad? Asshole. It's not an alliance. Not an aggression pact. Outworld is not our ally. Huh? What do you mean by that? A point you might make with more subtlety, given your surroundings. Now state your business, including a reason why we shouldn't kill you. I can read you. You're not from Outworld. I'm from Earthrealm, like you. But my employer, Kotal Khan, is from Outworld. So now I'm from Outworld. State your business. We're emissaries. We need to talk to Kotal Khan. Here, we have Raiden's official seal. <sighs> Look, you guys. I'm not sure if both of them are evil or not. I can buy one of those at that stall right over there. Look, you can arrest us, even kill us. But if we're telling the truth, you probably get a pay cut. Or worse. You take us to the con, I'll tell them you took us down. Maybe you get a bonus. You can't lose. What if we don't make it a deal with you guys? What will be happy? Follow me. In these times of war, we are required to view every resource as a weapon for our emperor to use at his discretion. To take without his leave is to steal from the hand of Kotal Khan himself. Therefore, Having been found guilty of theft, you shall be put to death. I was hungry. Your sentence will be carried out immediately. Death? For petty theft? Remember where you are. Jin? shouldn't have listened to you. Lesson in trust from a mercenary. Here's another learning opportunity. I'm a quick learner. Ah. 
Well, that was to us. You couldn't just ask for a pony like every other girl? The archives never mentioned symbiotes. to learn more about you. Too bad you're insane. You guys all right? Yes, this one must learn more of your diplomatic techniques. We sorry how we met you before. Let us guess. Trusty soup or something? We're here to see Kotal Khan. General Blaze. You interfere with outworld matters. The penalty is death. I'm sensing a theme. But, as we honor the Reiko Accords, we will consult the Emperor. You will await him here. You want to take this opportunity to tell us what the fuck shit you were thinking? I gotta wonder why you'd risk inter-realm war for a bread thief. Because not all thieves are irredeemable. Oh really? Then what happened in your past?
It has more sentimental than monetary value. Nevertheless, I would prefer you did not steal it. It's a family heirloom. One that shouldn't have been given to you. Your family honored me with this memento of your cousin Lao. After his death. A death you caused! You made him fight Shao Kahn! And stood there while that bastard snapped his neck! You go too far, Kung Jin. No. Not far enough. Just let me go. Blood of Kung Lao. Descendant of the great Kung Lao. A common thief. Did you think you could walk unimpeded into my temple? And walk out again? Without my complicity? You wanted me to attack you. Why? To release your anger. Make you amenable to reason. And make me feel like shit. Self-loathing has always been an unfortunate part of your makeup. There lies ahead a brighter path. One that will truly honor your ancestors. One that is worthy of you. Go to the Wuxi Academy. Join the Shaolin. Like Kung Lao before you. I can't. They won't accept. They care only about what is in your heart, not whom your heart desires. It's too late for me. It is never too late, Kung Jin. Your news of refugees is troubling. Their exodus to Earthrealm was not known to me. I do know this. I invited no guests from Earthrealm. Certainly none who would disrupt the execution of justice. How do I know you are not allied with Melina? Perhaps her newfound power has earned her new friends. Friends? No. No, we're not even sure that Shinnok's amulet she has- She employs Shinnok's amulet against me? The very item Earthrealm swore would be safe in its care? When Outworld was offered no participation- We were under attack, not Outworld. Odal Khan. The fire that burns the sun. We are here because we share your concerns about the missing item. We intend no ill against your rule. At least one Earthrealmer can forge words like silver. But I recall an Earthrealm expression. There is more honor among thieves than diplomats. I've had the questionable fortune to be both Emperor, but I'm telling you the truth. You are allied with Melina. You may carry out your sentence. Kotal Khan, under outworld law, I claim the right of defense by combat. What? You're gonna fight a duel? To absolve us of all accusations. Denying the request brings dishonor upon the accuser. You know much of Outworld. No, also, the duel ends in death. You have won nothing. Merely a few more seconds of breath. And now, Emperor? The charges against you are void. I say to all that Earth Realm means outworld no harm. Now kill me. Be done with it. You're not actually gonna. 
Instead of your life, I claim your service. If Melina does have the amulet, we can get it from her more easily if we work together. Emperor, they cannot be trusted. Vora, can you not perceive? I am indebted to them. Do we have the deal or not? Yeah, I know, and uh, we don't have no choice here. You honor us, Kotal Khan. Our gratitude is wide like the ocean. I'll talk to General Blade. Tell her about our new... arrangement. Thanks for the heads up, Sergeant.